wild finish out in Sober, uh, excuse me, Aberdeen, South Dakota for the Central Regional Championship between Northwest Missouri State and Host School Northern State. This one went into overtime to decide a winner. So for the highlights here, it's win or go home time for the Bearcats or the Huskies of Northern State. First half here, Parker Fox with the baseline drive and score. Then it'll be Luke Waters who gets denied by Fox, gives him a tumble, finger wag. Bearcat head coach Ben McCollum not too happy with this team's performance up to this point, but he gets his guys going. Ryan Hawkins with the nice drive there. He would finish with 21, nice little turnaround jumper off the glass. The Bearcats would go on a nice run. Byron Alexander with a strong finish. He would finish with 29 on the day. Then it'll be Luke Waters' turn with the pump fake, takes it to the hoop. Nice score there. Then the second half would be tied or going into halftime 36-35 here going into the second half. This is the second half here. Hudgens and Parker going back and forth in the second half. Hudgens with that three we showed you earlier in the broadcast. And then it'll be Parker Fox doing what he does. Nice takes inside here, going up strong, looking good there, and then having a nice Euro step. Gets the ball to roll around the rim and gets it to go. The Bearcats would go into overtime in advance, 91-86. They take their next game on to the Elite Eight of the NCAA Division II Men's College Basketball Tournament. And we will go to KQ2's Chris Roush with more in Aberdeen on this thriller in overtime. Chris, how was that atmosphere up there in the stadium with the final seconds of regulation and in overtime? Yeah, Adam, that was one of the craziest finishes to regulation, craziest game of the year, best game of the NCAA Division II year that I've seen this year in Northwest. You know, down 11 at one point in the second half. Parker Fox, Northern State, incredible basketball team. Northwest going up against tonight. Trevor Hudgens, though, second half went off, got the Bearcats back in it, nailed a three with four seconds to go to tie this game up, make it into overtime. Here's the thing. With both these teams, Northern had four guys foul out. Northwest had Diego Bernard foul out. It came down to a battle of who was basically left at that point in this ball game. But two good programs just going back and forth. Northwest now on to their third Elite Eight in the last four tournaments. The only one they didn't make, they were out in the first round of the NCAA tournament. The other two times that they made the Elite Eight, they went on to win a national championship 2017 as well as 2019. So the Bearcats going back to the Elite Eight. And one, one thing to really keep in mind here with this one, too, what Ben McCollum's doing right now, that's a chance now at three Elite Eights at this point. He's looking, he has a couple more games to go, but that's three national titles potentially in just four tournaments. This is an incredible run for the Bearcats. And you know, a couple people said the other day, too, this is one of those things where you want to enjoy it while you're in the moment because there's no guarantee that this is going to happen again for Northwest. But right now, a tremendous run by this Bearcat program. We'll find out who they'll be playing in the Elite Eight later on this week. Reporting from Northern State in Aberdeen, South Dakota, Chris Roush, Kick It Two Sports. All right.